Today we are testing out the Saramonic Blink 500 transmitter that goes directly into the iPhone compared to the DJI uh, mic that goes directly into the iPhone and as a baseline I have a Tentacle Sync E going to which have a screen capture of. Hold time, was it recording? This is Woodstock, New York Center. It's a overcast day on Saturday, day before Easter. I am using the Ceremonic Blink 500 directly into the data port on the phone. I am just doing a 360. Normally there's people playing music here and such, but it's Easter weekend. This is the Dutch Reformed Church from 1799. That's where I did my distance test. Woodstock, New York, day before Easter. This is the Dutch Reformed Church from 1799. I am now using the DJI mic. I picked the second transmitter just to see how it sounds. I can see my audio using Filmic Pro. This is the center of Woodstock, where normally there'll be a lot of people playing music and such. It's the day before Easter. We have an overcast day. Not too busy. This is just a 360 of me using the DJI mic, which I really love seeing the audio gains and, and the difference between this one and the Ceremonic is this is a dual channel direct plug-in. So this is just a test of the DJI without lavalier mic. We are testing out the Ceremonic Blink 500 transmitter that goes directly into the iPhone compared to the DJI uh, mic that goes directly into the iPhone. And as a baseline, I have a Tentacle Sync E going to which have a screen capture of. I'm going to walk towards this Dutch Reformed Church. This is a distance test with the Ceremonic Blink 500 transmitter that plugs directly into the phone. I am now just talking normally, walking towards the camera, as my wife Angela is recording me with Filmic Pro. We're capturing it in flat profile, so hopefully it sounds good. And now we're going to stop recording. Now, you're using the DJI, which is very small, DJI. Earlier we were using the Ceremonic Blink 500 with this attachment, the Blink 500 receiver. That was the earlier recording. I look all disheveled. It was in my pocket. And what I did was I used the a lavalier mic. Can I get this in my pocket? Yes, I can. So I have a lavalier mic. And the other one did have a fuzzy on too, so what I'll do is I'll put a fuzzy on this one. So this is the DJI mic, and I'm going to walk towards the church. This is the Dutch Reformed Church in Woodstock, New York. Walking with the DJI mic, handheld with a lavalier mic with a dead cat on it. Walking towards my wife. Hopefully it sounds good. We are in Woodstock, New York, in the center. And I'm going to stop. I am now using the Ceremonic Blink transmitter without lavalier mic in front of the Dutch Reformed Church in Woodstock, New York. This is the furthest distance I would be using this mic. We are doing a direct comparison test between this and the DJI, which are both plug in directly into the iPhone. 
and this is a test with the blink 500 max. 500 max. We are in Woodstock, New York, New York, in front of the Dutch Reformed Church in Woodstock. I am using the DJI mic at a distance that would be the furthest I would use. I have the DJI mic without the cord lavalier handheld. Just walking towards the camera. We are using Filmic Pro, and this is the DJI. So this is a video showing the Blink 500 with my wife's iPhone directly in the back of the from the back of her phone using the camera app and the audio that we're listening to on my phone is from the DJI mic. So the camera in the rear filming my wife's camera is the DJI mic. My phone has a the Blink 500. My wife's phone has This is just a test uh, showing my phone having the DJI on it. Well, technically, my wife's phone has the DJI. Let me try it again. This is a test showing my wife's phone, which is an iPhone 13 Max, using the Blink 500 on my wife's phone and the DJI on uh, my phone. Okay, thank you. Hopefully you enjoyed it. I'll put it together. Thank you.